Now to security matters. Men and officers of the Sokoto State Police Command are undertaking a three-day training workshop organized by the Nigeria Police Trust Fund. The training, which will take place in all the six geopolitical regions, is for the psychological development, human rights and rights of the police, and conflict management. The aim is to prepare the officers to protect the rights of citizens, protect the police against mob action and other unwarranted attacks by members of the public. And speaking at the training, the Inspector General of Police, Usman Akali Baba, represented by the Assistant Inspector General of Police in charge of Zone 10, Belo Dalija, says the training will also enhance the skills and expertise of the police personnel to brace to face emerging crime and challenges. Uh, not only the Nigeria Police Force, even members of the public are going to benefit from this uh, laudable program. Uh, in the sense that the uh, police trust fund uh, is normally for all Nigerians. So therefore, the psychological as well as human rights issue as enshrined in the Nigerian Constitution 1999 uh, is for all. Both members of the public and members of the police force, they are all Nigerians. So therefore, everybody's rights should be respected. Uh, one of the things we learn in the answers is that the police, out of our training, we were busy protecting every citizen of the country. The way our facilities and formation were attacked, our people from the background see us as not protecting ourselves. If we have a protection post to protect the police themselves, those things wouldn't have happened. Killings of the police and also as well as the Nigerian citizen borders on a whole lot of misunderstanding of the concept of the rights of both the police and the rights of Nigerians. And so this program was packaged by the grace of God through the recommendation of the Inspector General of Police.